today we are in Lyons and we are at Kansas Ethanol. We are joined today with Thane Combs. Thank you so much for your time today. No problem. All right, so tell me a little bit about Kansas Ethanol and what you all do here. We are a, an ethanol plant that um, produces annually 80 million gallons a year of um, fuel grade ethanol uh, produced from uh, grain, mainly corn, um, here or grown here in central Kansas. So when corn comes to you, we visited not only a farmer and a trucking service that moves the, the corn, but the third step is actually coming to you here at one of the ethanol plants in, in Kansas. So what happens when it arrives? Once the grain arrives on site, uh, we weigh the trucks inbound to get a full weight. Uh, we test the quality of the grain before um, we unload it. Uh, they will win, then weigh out um, to get a weight so we know how much to pay those farmers. And then from there we will actually process that corn into a flour where we will then send it to a cooking and a fermentation process where the ethanol is actually produced before we send it through our distillation process, separating it and making it a, a uh, motor grade fuel. Okay, so there's a lot going on, obviously. Tell me a little bit about the people that power this plant. Um, we currently employ 60 um, employees. Um, that's made up of administration, operations, and maintenance department. Um, the plant runs 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And it's actually ran by five individuals uh, on a 24 hour day basis. Man, you guys are busy. And so about how much ethanol is produced here? Um, from a bushel of grain, we produce about 2.9 gallons of ethanol. Um, approximately 16 pounds of distiller's grains and 16 pounds of CO2. And then where do you send that? Um, the ethanol that we produce here is actually sent to re, uh, refiners and blenders in Kansas and Oklahoma um, who process that into the gasoline stream and then ends up um, at the fuel pumps. Not only does ethanol come out of the grain, there are some other co-products as well. Yes, uh, we produce uh, high quality distiller's grain both in a wet and a dry form. Uh, we produce corn oil that's actually sold into the feed markets. Uh, we produce CO2 that's actually sold into the food processing. And then uh, part of our distiller's grains we further process here on site and actually make uh, pelleted um, products for beef cattle. One of 12 ethanol plants across the state. What makes you so special here? What, what kind of makes us unique is uh, we have diversified to have numerous co-products to add value back to our facility. But you're trying to extract um, the valuable portions of that kernel. So most people think of corn as uh, just a grain and we take that one kernel and create multiple uh, beneficial products for the agricultural as well as the motor industries. And I know that this happens to be in your family on a personal note, right? Yes, um, I grew up on several generations in um, agricultural base, whether it's livestock or crops, and uh, feel proud that I can do my part to help uh, this company and we can do our part to help um, provide a motor fuel that's uh, renewable, locally grown in Kansas, consumed, um, and just adding value back to agriculture. Well, Thane, thank you so much for your time today. If you are interested in learning more about Kansas-made ethanol, please visit fueledbykansas.com.